Hey, welcome back to the Comic Completer. I'm going to show you the dollar comics I found that this, this comic book store sells all these dollar books. And we'll go ahead and get started. So, I collect Adventures of Superman. I think I need like 15 of them to complete the series. This is number 543. I found this. This is pretty cool. This is a 1 in 25. Aliens, this is volume three, I believe. Number two variant edition. Look at that white alien, pretty cool. That's cool when you find a one in 25. Aliens, Earth War. I just pick up anything aliens. Eventually, I'll have them all. Three of four, that's pretty cool. That was back in the 90s, by the way. Um, and I pick up all these variants of Judgment Day or Empire or, or War of the Realms. I just like them all. It's just cool. Uh, Batman Superman, um, number 10. Uh, I try to complete this series as well. It's nice art. Black Mantra, Man Manta. Why did I keep throwing the R in there? Black Manta, 6 of 6. I have number 1. Number 5 is a key, and I put it back, and I kind of beat myself up for it. Devil Ray's Last Stand. Found this Peach Momoko, um cover of Black Panther volume 4 it's a number 7 variant edition I just thought that was so cool how cool is that Black Panther it's pretty cool uh, I found this Champions it's a local comic book store edition it's in the very local comic book store edition and um, they had it marked up to 10 bucks and then I got it for a buck um, so this is the first champion or champions volume 2 pretty cool looking um, this is, uh, Champions Volume 4, number 2, when they were outlawed. Pretty cool. Remember I told you about aliens? Oh, uh, they look like an alien right there. This is, uh, Justin Jordan's, um, I think it was, who does this, uh, Avatar Comics? This is Dark Gods. That's pretty cool. And that was number 1. This is number 2. That's pretty cool. Dead Man Logan. I try to pick up all these. There's 12 in the series, and I think I have three of them. But uh, check that out. Sabretooth up in the corner. This is number nine. And then this one right here it goes for a little bit of money. It's uh, Deadpool number 19. Oh, I forgot what volume, number five or something like that. It shows like a first appearance of one of these guys on the cover. Pretty cool. Um, Deadpool number 23. Pretty cool. Deadpool number seven. I think that, that last volume was three. This is number four. This is a variant of him versus Conan. This is number seven. Pretty funny. Like Conan's got his ass. And Deadpool: The Last Days of Magic came out with like five variants. I have this would be number four. I just need one more variant, and uh, then that is complete. It's a one shot. Pretty funny. See the guys in the background too. Yeah, pretty funny. Uh, this one right here is, um, Department of the Truth. The guy wrote Something's Killing the Children. This is number 13. I believe this is the one that... No, this isn't. So, this is number 13. It's pretty cool. Nominated for 2021's Iser Awards, including Best New Series. This is number 14. This one goes for a little bit of money. I think it's $13. It's the origin of the lady in the red dress. A dollar. Um... And this is number 15. Yeah, number 15. So, Doctor Strange came out with Surgeon Supreme. I think there's six issues, five issues or six issues in the series. This is number three. And that's number five. Yeah, five issues, I believe. I think this is the last issue. Yeah, welcome to the Bizarre Bazaar. Pretty cool. Remember I told you I get a lot of variants of uh, certain uh, titles? But this is Empire number one. Look at that. That's so cool. That's cool. And this is another variant of number one. Pretty good. And this is another variant of number one, but I think this is second printing. Now tell me, that art is so bad. I think it's Inuk Lee or whatever they call his name. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And this is the Empire number three variant. I forget. I don't know who the artist is, but man, look at that. It's Johnny Storm. Excalibur came out with a series, I think it's volume four. Oh, that was Frank Choi art. Um, volume four, and they had second prints on a lot of their stuff. This is number five, and the second prints were green. 
And this is number 12, second print. Pretty sick. Extraordinary X-Men. I just recently completed this series and I said, whoa, well, I don't have that. It's a variant edition of Women in Power. It's actually, it goes for more money than the regular one. I mean, it's a pretty cool cover. Fantastic Four, um, Volume 6, Number 4, Variant. How cool is that? It says, Welcome to Yancey Street. This is Volume 6, Number 8, um, Variant. How cool is that? That's cool. This is Number 11. Well, that was Puzzle Quest. I don't know what that means. This is number 11. How do you not pick this up for a dollar in a variant edition? I mean, that is just cool. Um, Heroes Reborn uh, Siege Society variant. Uh, look at this cover. It's so cool. And they got new characters on there, too, like Fire Ant, stuff like that. Yeah, look at Hawkeye. Yeah. I mean, a dollar. I mean... And the price tag on the front was five fifty. Uh, Infinity Wraps Iron Hammer number one variant edition. Cool. Uh, I didn't know I didn't know who Z Zdarsky was back when he was doing these uh, Invaders. I have almost all of them. I just need two issues left to get. But uh, still, killer cover. Trying to complete uh, Justice League Volume Two. I've completed mostly all my Justice Leagues, but. Um, so this one is uh, number 36, and that is so cool. One of the rules of picking up comics when, like, you know, I have people, whoever helps me, one of the rules is if there's a whole bunch of people on the cover, pick it up. It's probably worth uh, probably worth some money or something. I guess Sinestro back in the old costume. Yeah, that was number uh, 36. I have Justice League Dark number 40, volume 1. But um, I have the variant. This is the regular cover. It's the last issue. And you see who the last man standing is, right? This is the Justice League Odyssey. I just pick these up once in a while. One day I'll complete the series. I'm not really hard on the series. But remember what I said. There's a bunch of people on the cover. You pick it up. This right here goes for a little bit of money. This is uh, Magic Masters of Metal. This is number, I mean, one shot. And this is like the black and white version, I guess. And on the cover, it said nine fifty. I think it's a $10 book. Dollar. I love it. Um, this right here is Western Marvel Westerns Outlaw Files. Want it. Well, who's on the cover? The original Ghost Rider, Slade. And a couple other guys. Two-Gun Kid. Brawl. Brawl. Uh, I forgot his name. But there's a bunch of guys on the cover. Remember I said a bunch of people on the cover? Um... This is Marvel Ant-Man Prelude to the movie. There's two of them, but there's number one. This is Middle West. Well, what's the big deal about Middle West? Well, I'm going to tell you what the big deal is. There's a little cover, a little guy on the cover named Scotty Young. That's why. Right, this is a second print variant of number five. No, number two. Number two. And this is number five. See the name? Scotty Young. And then this is number eight, I do believe. Number eight. I don't know if he did the covers or not, but still, his name's on the cover. I'm trying to complete Nightwing. I know it's not gonna. There's no money in Nightwing, but um, I've been collecting the new series for a while, and I've got a lot of the old. I've got a lot of old stuff. Let me get that back sharp. And um, this is number five, the new 52. I think I have one through five now. Pretty cool. And this is uh, number 77. Nice cover. Again, I paid a dollar for all these things. You can't go wrong with a dollar. Especially when they sell tons of stuff that you have to dig through. This is Punisher Soviet number 4. It's the only Soviet I have a Punisher. But uh, there's like 6 issues in the series. And I'm trying to complete them all. Because I'm the comic book completer. This series, this comic came out. This comic came out in the 2020, and it was hard to get. If This one's very hard to get. It's Savage Avengers number zero. Most people don't know it. The volume one started with number zero. Well, now it's all completed. Volume one and volume two. Sons of Anarchy number two of six. 
and I have number one, but you know, it was it went more than six. I think it went to twenty five or something like that. Spider Man the X Men. I have um almost the whole series. I think I need one issue to complete the series. Yeah, I dropped my ball on that one big time. Um, Spy Island. This looks interesting. Bermuda Triangle Mystery. I will try to pick up some more of these. Um, it looks good. I can't wait to read it. It's a dark horse. So they had this there for a dollar. Star Wars, Darth Vader, the last uh, series that came out. And I have number 41, but I didn't have this number A cover. And this is A cover. Star Wars Dark Droids number, what is this? Number five, variant edition. I think I need number four. I missed one comic in this one, and it kind of irritated me, so one day I'll find it again. But uh, it's a cool cover. So Strange came out with a miniseries not r recently, and this is uh, number six, the variant edition. Anytime you see America Chavez on the cover, you should pick it up. Uh, this is the Superior Spider-Man number six, a tale of two doctors. Well, I um, number seven is the one that has Jeff on the cover for the first time. So Tony Stark Iron Man came out with a whole bunch of these covers, uh, different covers for um, for Iron Man. This is Model Prime armor. I've got like four or five of them, so why not just keep getting them? If I can get them for a dollar, I mean, it'd be stupid not to. So this is the modular armor. And I didn't ever, I didn't know this existed. Ultimate Comics, Iron Man number one. So, I mean, Iron Man number one, one of the things I um, I talk about is always uh, get number ones if you can. So, number one, how about that? Uncle Sam. Um, I've been collecting Uncle Sam f uh, just recently, and it's been some off-the-wall stuff. But, uh, I mean, I love Phantom Lady. She's hot. And, uh... Multiple people on the cover. Remember I said that? And this is actually a key comic. Pretty cool. Vengeance of Moon Knight, number one. Variant edition. Well, these go for about $6 each. And I got them for a dollar a piece. It's one variant. Number two variant. Number two variant. Number three variant. $6, $6, $6. And then uh, this one right here is uh, Warlord of Mars, DJ... Horus. Anytime you see her and she's hot, pick it up. Um, what if Punisher number 57 became an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Well, didn't the last Punisher, wasn't he an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Uh, I already own this book. What if uh, Cannonball's little brother Josh and his pet Sentinel? This is the second one of these I have. This right here is um, Wildcats volume 2 number 20. This completes Wildcats number 2. I mean, it was a, it was hard to get that whole series, but I finally did it. And this is uh, Wonder Woman, um, the new 52. Um, this is issue number 52. Even though it doesn't say new 52 on it, it's the last issue, so why not pick it up? So, and then those are some other books. But I got both the other. I got those done, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna start putting stuff in a box tonight. Complete another box. Well, thanks for watching. If you like this type of stuff and if you want to watch more, watch more, like and subscribe. I appreciate everything. Leave a comment. Nobody ever comments. All right. See you later. Have a great day.